Hello everyone, I am Lord Stencil, and I just realized that last game, I forgot to make sure that everything was set, and it turned out my bandit cam, I forgot to make sure that it was using the full version and not a trial thing, so then the logo did not come at the top, and that was my fault. That's why it turned off after 10 minutes. But we're okay. We're moving on. Woo! Little crank. Hopefully... Everything works out fine after 10 minutes, uh, we're gonna figure that out. What is this? Pump it up. What if we want to push it down as far as we can? know what I was doing. That's a cool brew we checked out. Alright. Why is there a calm broken? I feel like I would have took out some of the pipes with it. I don't know why I lit that up. Oh! I was right about the pipes. That's why I need the boxes. So I can keep moving it and everything. Oh, did I do it in this room too? Alright. See, it was even lit up, letting you know. Hey, Stencil! Get it! I don't even know if I said, Hello, I'm Blood Stencil! Oh, I'm... I don't even know. I don't even know! I'm sorry, I'm so far behind! Alright, let's go get everything else. We don't need a chair. I messed up. I uh, don't. See what I have to deal with? <clears throat> I can't even knock it down. This saddens me. Alright. Let's get it in there so I don't knock my boxes down. Cha! Oh, we didn't check out this room, did we? Oh, everything's down. But I found another one. No, no! Hey! Stop! Work together, guys! Cha! Alright. What is you? Who paper? But nothing's on the paper. That's weird. Hold this up. I'm about to have to match it, don't I? January 19, 1799. The workout put into this machine is unequal by unequaled by the reasoning of any man, and the thought of the ge that generations of men have passed away since I first attempted to reconstruct the design is most tiring. The limitations of the world have made my work incredibly difficult, and it has forced me to build a thing almost a hundred times larger than the delicate contraption it tries to emulate. Not to mention the flow of the tamed lightning crudely replaced by the pressure steam pushing its way through the pipes and turbines. It shames me to think of what the inventor would have thought of my monster. 
While he works with a magnifying glass to carefully fix all the parts, I push five men to erect a tower of rot. Rot? What? Iron. And hope it will have the tiniest hint of the power found in the traveler's locket. Like the Sisterhood of Traveling Pants? I don't know why I even brought that up. <laughs> Sounded like I could. Probably could. Oh well, moving on. Hello. Hello, hello. I don't know where any other parts are. I'm gonna guess maybe here, but then I guess I'm thinking, yeah, yeah, I guess. He's stuck in position. So that's all stuck. I got a piece from this room or not. I'm gonna guess that I didn't. Hopefully find a piece. Cause I can't find crap. Hello? Hello? Is anybody there? Does anybody even care? Oh, I thought I, this is a lever. It's not. Is there maybe a piece in this room that I've literally, like, Neglected it so much. I wonder. Nope. I'm so angry. <laughs> nope. Hmm. I, I swear there's probably got to be another piece somewhere. Everything that I tried to accomplish is done. Maybe it's near the front. Maybe I just missed it and it was laying on the ground somewhere. No? No? Ready? Uh, it's, I can't reference that, but I like it so much. Sometimes I just realize I'm talking to myself and it kind of helps me a little bit. I'm gonna have to leave the room. On. She's upset. I'm not laying down with her. Ah, uh, sorry. Okay. All right, let's continue the next round. Maybe something will happen and knock down a pipe. Kiss her, sister, sister, sister. sister. I had to think about it a little bit. I have eight minutes on. Sometimes I stare at myself, I'm just like... Oh, this looks like it's full of wonderful things. That I can just... You're conserving water from the spring. Yes, it enables me to control the water in the drain sewers to some extent. Also, it can be used for all sorts of purposes. Like the drinking room. Well, that too. But mostly to run different machines. Ah, like water mills. Exactly. One question. I don't know if I've been paying attention, but how did Alexander get on this into this? Because I could have sworn I was doing my own thing. And then Alexander just kind of popped his head up like, what's up? Or maybe, no, I ended up in this castle, didn't I? I don't trust you. Oh man. I don't like walking along. Hey! No one's in here. Sounds like someone was. Said that really, really like. Hey! Hey! Hey you! Hey sexy boy! It's not me, man. It's not me! Oh, Lego bro. I feel so weird when I have to like stop and look at that because I'm not used to that. But Amnesia is just so wonky with this jumping for me. I'm not used to it at all. What is this? Oh, 
Oh, oh, oh, oh, oh. oh. Okay, so I gotta get water in there. I saw the pipe above it. Uh, whoosh. Whoosh. I really should have read the paper. <laughs> there are valves in the cistern to redirect water from the sewer. 7th of August, 1839. Oh, there is no denying that Alexander puts a lot of faith into what I can only describe as magic. I'm not surprised. Even while traveling across Europe, I assumed I would have to embrace the supernatural to save my mind and life. As a novice, I do everything in my power to stay focused and not dwell too much on my own doubts. Alexander woke me up early and told me it was time we got started on our work. He was obviously excited to get going, and we headed downstairs to the old dungeon, where he preferred to attempt his rituals. It turns out that Alexander is a true Renaissance man, paralleled only by da Vinci, I'm sure. He showed me several rooms fitted for specific research, such as anatomy studies, alchemy, and botany. The crown of Brennenburg must be the inner sanctum, a most hallowed ground where we shall attempt to permanently banish the orb's shadow. But he's going to use that shadow to his whim to become more powerful, isn't he? Oh, I could have done that the whole time. I thought I had to like be special at it or something. Oh, see, yeah, there we go. Let's go. Go. Nothing to hurt me, but my hurt myself. I'm going to heal. I'm crystal clear and all is good. I don't know why everything's gotta give me the weird, awkward stuff. Attacks by rusty chain to the ceiling, which one fun. A bridge must be lowered down to proceed. I'm guessing that's why they set these little rocks here for me. Chabuski! That's my group. On Steam. Join it or be square. What about that? There we go. Oh. 8th of August, 1839. I could never be certain until today that I was on the right path. Using my orb, Alexander managed to channel its power unto us. The inner sanctum flared with blue, fiery light, and I could feel the same things I felt in the dark chamber in Algeria. It was like standing in a mad whirlpool of impressions. It was terrifying, but Alexander kept calm and wielded strange tools of science in order to tame the storm. Suddenly, the blue light was stained by strains of red, and the walls burst with pulsating tissue resonating with the scene. Alexander quickly covered the orb in some cloth, and the unspeakable thing vanished. Apparently, the orb's shadow is closer than Alexander thought. He said I should prepare for a warding ritual tomorrow. I'm not sure what he expects, but I have a bad feeling about I this. I understand. I bet Alexander actually, the only reason it's it's going on right now, and why he probably took amnesia, or a drink, I don't know why he actually took the drink yet, but I'm sure he's actually did the whole thing because he didn't want to get hurt. He wanted to save his skin, as everyone should know. Humans are more likely to go against everything they know just to save their own skins. It's it's nature, it's an instinct. So maybe that's it. Or the other fact is he just wanted power. Maybe. Oh, one of these puzzles. <laughs> it scared me. Screw you. That hurt. I don't have any LaDonna. I really should have been more, like, pristine with it. Or not pristine. Any fishy fish? Oh, another one. 9th of August, 
1839. It is still early, and Alexander is busy preparing for the ritual later today. Seeing him this worked up makes me question why. What does he stand to gain? I realize he is curious about it all, but surely there must be more. Is he so foolish he will attempt to tame the power of the orb? I must admit that yesterday, when Alexander flooded the inner sanctum with blue light, I realized we had but graced the orb's true potential. This might turn out to be more than escaping a creeping shadow. It might be the beginning of something truly extraordinary. I'm sorry if I check my phone, you know, I, I'm making sure my... Making sure my girlfriend is a-okay, because I didn't warn her that I was recording. She doesn't like it. gotta be doing this for his own personal gain. There is no other way or reason for him to be going after all this. Uh, anyway, I have to actually stop this all here, which I'll stop it like that. But thank you everyone who watches this. I'm sure you're having as fun a time as I am figuring out the story behind Amnesia. But, <laughs> with all due and said, leave a like, favorite, subscribe, and I'll see all of you in a later episode. Goodbye, everybody! Helicopter! Helicopter! Ooh! <laughs> <laughs> he just ran! Oh, big cat, Oh, Jesus! Okay!